In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use a bamboo build to create a release and to deploy that release into one of our RDS hosted environments. A prerequisite for this operation is logging off users that are running the HDS view application in the environment to which we are deploying and creating a new branch build for the HDS view power builder application. Those topics were covered in previous videos. Once the build that was initiated from the previous video finishes, you will see a bamboo page that looks like this. From this screen, you, so you want to click the create release button. That will bring us to this create new release deployment for view screen. On this screen, you want to give the uh, release a version name that see, that makes sense for what it is we're doing. Usually this is date based, but for this uh, video, I'm just going to name it the same as the branch we used prod push sample. Then we can create that release. That will bring us to a screen that shows us what releases are deployed to what environments. Uh, with the prod push sample release uh, in focus. We can then choose to deploy this to any of the environments that we want to. Um, I'm going to go ahead and there's a couple of ways you can do it. You can click the arrow pointing to the cloud uh, on any of the environments, or you can also select the environment from the deploy button drop down. I'm going to go ahead and deploy this into dev. This will start the deployment uh, once we hit the start deployment button and we'll go ahead and do that and we'll see it work through the deployment. This takes a little bit of time to copy the files out and uh, move the files but you will see the logging information track here i will let this run for a couple of minutes until it completes And with the com uh, deployment complete, uh, you get a success message, and that concludes the deployment of a release into the desired HDS View Power Builder application RDS environment.